Hey everyone, Dr. Ed here from Atopical Psychological Services. Um, I've decided that I'm going to start creating a video that goes along with the blogs that I release on a weekly basis. I'm going to work backwards and start with the post that I just released today, which is on uh, the idea of parental burnout, which I think is something that uh, may be particularly relevant uh, uh, given our, our current situation where some of us may be juggling uh, multiple roles within the same environment. So maybe we're trying to work full time while still being a parent, or maybe Maybe we, uh, there's an added stress in the, ho in the home uh, uh, based on lost jobs, um, you know, the expectations of having to complete schoolwork with your kids, all these other variables that may be sort of impacting our day-to-day. -day. Uh, there could be an increase in stress, a depletion of energy, which uh, can lead to uh, an increase of, of developing parental uh, burnout. Um, and so th the blog will walk you through some of the, the symptoms, so things like feeling overly ex uh, exhausted in relation to your role as a parent, feeling as if you are creating space between you and your child, so perhaps you're only doing the bare minimum for them, or finding that you're less efficient as a parent, so things like uh, being uh, losing your temper more easily. Those are some of the warning signs. It also talks about things that may increase the chances of burnout, so things like uh, feeling as if everything has to be perfect or watching uh, you know our friends post and everything seems perfect in their lives and and that and making us feel worse about so, sort of what we're experiencing or maybe sort of beliefs that we may that may be triggered like you know I, it's it's not normal to feel as if I'd rather be somewhere else than be with my kids or that I'm not enjoying myself while I'm spending time with my kids and sometimes we can beat ourselves up over some of these thoughts that may come up um, and so if you've seen previous posts I do talk about things uh, like related to to mindful parenting, uh, the first step being starting to notice some of these things that are happening, uh, becoming more mindful and present in the moment so that we're not stuck in some of these uh, thought patterns that may pop up. The other thing about the blog post this week, it will also provide resources. So there's a link there to a questionnaire that will actually help you to, to understand and, and measure whether this is a concern for you. Um, uh, so go to the, to the blog post, you'll find that link. Uh, it's, a, it's a great questionnaire that you could complete. Uh, and there's also links to resources where you can connect with other, other parents in Toronto or Etobicoke who may be struggling from some of the same or struggling with some of the same things you may be struggling with. So please go to the blog post uh, at atopicalpsych.com and if you uh, want to reach out with any questions, email us at info at atopicalpsych.com. Thank you very much. Take care.